All right, it's time to start our Minecraft adventure, and I'm in the lake. Mm. Horrible spawn area. What if I weren't paying attention and drowned? I guess I'd just respawn right there, but again, seems like an animal suit would be drowning. Not fun. Not fun at all. Well, first things first, let's get uh, some higher ground, because higher ground is safer ground. Aw, oh, yeah. Easier to defend. We'll make ourselves an artificial stairway to get up to the higher ground. Gathering up some dirt along the way. Dirt. One of the most important resources in the game. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. That's why it's so bountiful. Yes. And we're still making a stairway. This isn't tedious at all. Ah. Light. What do we got up here? Some trees, a lot of cobblestone, I saw some coal already. Well, might as well gather up some wood. So we can make ourselves some tools, because tools are necessary for survival. Punching trees. That's how manly men get their wood. Aw, oh, yeah. Wolf's gonna be super jealous that I got all this wood and there's none for him. Lo 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 lo. Ah, thank you, Dad. For not sliding out from underneath me like you would in real life. Just punching trees. Punching trees for days. That was a tiny tree. Let's see. Got some wood. Kind of need to use this wood to make a table so I can make some tools and establish a base. Base establishment. One of the most important first things you will ever do in Minecraft. Oh, yes. Come on now. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. Place down my table. Get myself some wood planks, which I then turn into sticks. Only to realize I didn't get enough wood planks for myself. Try this again. There we go, wooden pickaxe. And now I can carve out stone, yes! Ah, oh, what a perfect base. Just big enough for me to stand in. Now time to gather up coal so I could light my way as well as cook my food without wasting precious wood. And cobblestone for days. More coal. This is actually a pretty good spawn area. I have trees, I have water, pretty sure I saw some animals nearby. I have this sweet, like, mountainy terrain that I can carve into to make my base. Because mountains make the best bases. Because they are naturally forming, and you could just carve out your rooms. Easy peasy. But first, we need to continue gathering coal, because you can never have enough coal. NEVER! Gathering up that coal, gathering up that coal. Ah, that was a pretty, uh, a pretty decent coal vein. What was that, a good, good, like, ten pieces of coal from that one alone? Something like that. What are we doing? Oh, gather up some saplings. Saplings are pretty cool. Grow myself a tree farm later. That's the plan. Yep. Oh, another big vein of coal. If it continues being super tedious, I'll like fast forward through it for you. So you guys aren't just watching me like do tedious things the entire time. But for now, we're gonna be tedious. 
productively tedious, but tedious nevertheless. Gathering up more coal. Yeah. Already level two, haven't even killed anything. Just from harvesting coal. Thank goodness, because I'm totally going to get an enchanting table almost immediately. Probably not. There's a fair chance that I'll die before I get to use these levels. But I appreciate the fact that they're here. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, sheep. Perfect. Because I need sheep so I can take their wool and make a bed. I'm probably going to make several crafting tables when I don't need to. Because there's ones that are really close by. But hey, that is the price you pay to adventure. No, no it's not. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Uh, it doesn't sound very sincere. I don't know that I can believe you. Oh, well, um, I'm totally sure. Yes, yes. This is the price you pay. No, oh, well, I may get if you say so. Well, I do. I do say so. Alright, no need to get hostile. <sighs> getting sick of your stuff. I'm getting sick of your stuff. What were we doing? Making a base. Right. Let's continue carving where this coal was. Because we're already a little bit into it. And it has an entrance-like structure, by which I mean it indents into the mountainside. And now I broke my pickaxe. All the sad feels. Oh, oh. I'm a white chickens. Need to use my crafting table. Oh yeah. And more sticks. Yes, a better pickaxe. One that will certainly last longer. Back to carving out my room. What are you doing here? Just carving out a stairway. Probably should have sped this part up. Well, I'll speed it up later. Yeah, totally fine. But we have a cave system in here already. Fantastic. But not for this moment. I'll come back to this later. I've deemed it as important. And I'll mark it off by these cobblestones. Which I will use to fill this space. And continue digging. What else do we have going on in here? Just a stairway. Yeah, I really feel like I probably should have sped this part up as well. And for that, I apologize. Next time for sure, like anything super tedious where I'm just digging and not doing anything, will definitely be sped up. I mean, you know, technically speaking, it's like an important part of the journey. Like, I'm doing stuff, but it's like stuff that's uninteresting to watch. Self-awareness, aw, oh, yeah. Ah, top of the mountain. It's very snowy up here. What really is an issue in terms of having a farm. 
but I'm in the middle of like it looks like two or three biomes. Like I'm in the winter biome right now, obviously. But it looks like there's like some grasslands that are covered in snow. And then I think I saw some like thick foresty area in the other direction. So I mean again, like this is definitely like a pretty fantastic spawn area. Let's light these up so nothing spawns in the darkness. Because the last thing I need is to have some creatures chilling in my house. Especially since the sun's going down. Make ourselves another crafting table, even though, you know, there's this one right right over there. It's cool though. Whatever. Let's see. I need a space for it. This'll do. This will do nicely. Got a headroom for my bed as well. Beds are important because I don't want to be awake up top whenever uh, it's daylight. So we'll just make a bed using some wood and some wool. I'm sure, that's a super comfortable bed. We'll make a door to keep things out and drop a piece of wood like that. And place our door out too far, and we'll just box it in, extending my house. Ah, it's good old land. Yes, yes. Now we need to continue carving. Carving out my home. Super tedious stuff, yeah! Who needs illumination? This guy. Ah, let's take a rest. Make some stairs. Make a furnace. <laughs> ah, yes. That cave that we ran into earlier. Now that I've gotten everything set up that I need to, it's time to go explore. It is a, it's a mighty fall. Thank goodness I have my trusty pickaxe. Hmm. There we go. Another room that I carved out earlier. Now I have two ways into this cave still. Definitely gonna wanna put up doors because there's likely some creatures just chilling down there waiting to kill me. It's just their nature. They can't help it. I don't blame them. It's not even in my nature to kill them. But that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Oh yeah. Almost want to edit that part out. There's probably going to be an issue with the volume. These things happen. I blame Wolf. Technically, he has nothing to do with this, but it's his fault, anyways. We're making our way down the shelves. We'll go see what kind of jewels and whatnot are down there. Aw, oh, yeah. Treasure hunting for days. We're definitely close to the bottom here, which is fantastic. Because that means I should be able to uh, 
to go explore them pretty soon. Most of my time in caves, so be prepared. I'm a cave dweller. That's where I'd go. I dwell. I do my dwellings. Yeah, dwelling in a cave. So far, so good. Nothing. Uh, nothing's been sighted yet. It looks like this is a, a single path. Like it's not like I came in like a branching pair of creatures and I'm not prepared to fight a bunch of them in this open area so we're gonna flee flee for our lives let's get out of here nope still falling us it's all right we'll leave them over here and prepare to slaughter them as soon as they walk into the room. Hey, hey! Quit shouting, babe! It's rude! There we go, perfect. But I'm starving. Well, not starving, but my hunger can definitely use a boost. Thank goodness I got those three chickens earlier. Nom 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 Thanks, phone. It's cool. Not recording or anything. It's staying like that. I'll turn that off next time. What do we got down here? Some zombies are still chilling. What's up, zombie? Hey, huh? There we go. Let's wall this off for a moment. Hey, hey. Back up. More zombies? Go away. What if there's like a spawner nearby? Ooh, a potato. Super good. Oh, that's gonna be sweet. I'm gonna have to save that for my garden. Farm. Be farming. For now we're gonna wall this off. And we'll come back down later when we have a door. We'll put a door in. This way nothing's getting in. And my house remains safe. Probably also get a proper stairway going to get down here because, you know, having the jump constantly affects my food, my food hunger bar. And I do not need it to be all, all the time from me constantly jumping all over the place. You understand. You're all very wise people who understand the needs of Minecraft Steve. Let's see. Stone staircase. Blocking myself in. Get these blocks out of my way. Cobblestone. Level us out a little bit. Because level things are again easier to traverse. And I'm probably gonna call this about it. Uh so that was the that was essentially day one and two. Because I went to sleep earlier of um, a Minecraft adventure and whatnot. We're going to finish walling some stuff off and I'll see you guys next time. When I get to go down there and explore cave systems and whatnot. And probably die and scream like a little girl. Aw yeah. Well, see you guys then.